feeling fiery, are about to go up and uh, nose the machine. Starting in the lane, down to the judge and two for the last out of Wagga, the Breeders' Challenge Regional Finals, August 4. They're about to get going, the green twinkling light. We're off in the last out of Wagga Wagga and a lovely level break. 28 Black began very, very quickly from out wide and is going forward in the early stages. I'm feeling fiery together with Spike Robin and Magic in racing and 28 Black continuing to surge but out full wide. He'll get in when they get around that first corner. They're being followed by Mac Charm who got through brilliantly and the number nine horse sits on the leaders back early. Now back to midfield when that settled down was a so cool master as they raced in towards the back section. They were being followed through on the inside by Most Delightful. Now Beta House is well back with Molly Kelly and there's another one back with those last of all in Barkway Arnold. They've made their play down towards the uh, mile portion of the course and the leader on the inside is uh, Spike Robin is joined by 28 Black who knows only one thing and that's to get up and work outside that leader's wheel now. In fact he's gone up to the leader's neck so Spike Robin to 28 Black. Max Sam getting a lovely run. On the inside is third. Now one and one uh, was I'm Feeling Fiery. Over on the inside is So Cool Master. They're being followed by Grinning Punter. Further back to Beta House and then well back was Philandera being followed further back in the field by Most Delightful who's on the outside. Barclay Arnold made a little bit of ground up along the inside. Second last was Molly Kelly. Magic in Racing was last of all and the dozen of them sweep past the judge. A lap to play. They've gone 31 and 8 the first cut of the last mile and Molly Kelly is still back second last. The leader on the inside is Spike Robin and they converge upon the Cartwright's Hill corner at the 850. Spike Robin to 28 Black. Max Sam is third. I'm feeling fiery has pulled hard on the outside. Further back to So Cool Master and then as they headed down the back the next one then was Grinning Punter. They're followed by Beta House. Harpley's about to ask Molly to go from the 700 but she's got a lot of horses in front of her uh, moving around the outside of them now and further back in the fight then coming on the outside of those was Magic and Racing most delightful Barkway Arnold have gotten well back into the field as they come and so to Philandera but they've bunched right up they've gone 30 and 5 the second quarter and as a 28 and 9 the third the leader on the inside is still Spike Robin now Molly Kelly she's out 5 and 6 deep the class mare can she round them up in the lane Molly. Spike Robin down near the inside. Molly Kelly with Grinning Punter. It's still Spike Robin in front. Molly's coming hard out wide. Max Sam on the inside. Molly Kelly, Max Sam, Grinning Punter. A great finish in the last at Wagga Wagga. They drive to the line. It's going to be Oh, to touch a photo, it's either Max Sam or Grinning Putter, and there's absolutely nothing in it with those two. Molly Kelly was up close, and so too was So Cool Master and Philander, a Spike Robin. I'm feeling fiery. Beta House, most delightful. What a finish to the last of the day. Further back then was Magic in Racing, and 28 Black just did too much work outside the leader and is going to be one of the last ones clocking home.